Hello, my dear friends of the world, Paul the Trombonist here, and in this video, I'm going to show you where the slide positions are on the trombone. Now, I know what you're thinking. Some of you are like, I know where the slide positions are. Well, if that happens to be you, you're still going to want to stay here because I'm sure there's some different things that you haven't heard before, and you're not going to want to miss it when at the end of this video, I twirl around on the chair holding the banana. So don't go anywhere. Okay, so we are talking about slide positions. Oh my gosh, slide positions. So it can be a little confusing just because we don't have buttons or keys or uh, those mechanisms that other instruments have. So we got to rely on muscle memory. But I'm promising you that the more that you utilize your muscle memory, they call it muscle memory for a reason because you have a memory of where your muscles were. So the more repetition, the simpler it's going to be. But we have some principles that we can start to think and imagine to understand where the slide positions are. So there are seven positions on the trombone. We got seven slide positions on the trombone. The first position is going to be right here, right at the top. So it's close all the way in is first position. Okay. Second position is going to be a little bit out like this, all right? About an inch. Now this is the thing. These positions change depending on what note range you're playing at the time, but this is a general idea. These are also different on different instruments depending on the tendencies of each different instrument. But we do have to have a general idea to start with to build the foundation. So we got second position, about an inch out there. Then we got third position which goes Generally speaking, right around the bell. So right where the crease is at the bell, that's third position, okay? Fourth position is going to be a little past the bell. Just a little tiny past the bell. You see where that's at? And then we got fifth position where it's about the same distance again, one, one half step down farther. So every single slide position that goes down, it goes down what we call chromatically, which is in half steps, which is the shortest distance between any two pitches in Western music. So now we're at fifth position. We're going to go to sixth position, and you're going to go right about there, okay? Right about there, and then we're going to go to seventh position, which is about as far as it goes without falling off. So the way we can practice this is we're going to practice chromatically, and we're going to do it on the lowest partial, which is the, the lowest resonating pitch, other than the pedal tone, which we could talk about in another time. But check it out. This is the exercise you're going to do here, okay? So there are many different exercises you can do. You could do uh, on a different partial. Go back up. Here's a great exercise to really uh, check your intonation, which is how in tune your pitches are. So this is a really great exercise for that. And what you're going to do is you're just going to simply go back to first position as you go out to seventh position. So you're just going to go, basically going to go, you're going to go one, two, one, three, one, four, one, five, one, six, one, seven. Go back up six, like this. So 
So that's that. And uh, you just practice it slow and you'll get it. You're, the more repetition you do, that you're going to totally get it. It's going to be a simple piece of cake. No problem. Just repetition. Do it a little bit each day. You're going to totally get it. Now, if you haven't downloaded your free sound guide, I made a free sound guide. It's been helping thousands of people's trombone playing sound. Uh, get your free copy down below. Just click the link in the description and we will send you that sound guide. Uh, it's just some ideas that I've developed over the past, I don't know, 20 some years now of doing this trombone stuff. So that's there for you. So make sure you get that. And as promised, oh, also, if you enjoy this stuff, let me know where you're from. Let me know what's going on, what kind of videos you like to see and stuff. And uh, turn on the notifications and subscribe to the channel. I mean, that's important, right? But as promised, here's the moment you've all been waiting for. This is the moment where we take the chair, the banana, and I twirl around in a circle like I promised you. I promised it. You know, I'm always good on my promise for you guys. All right. Don't mess this up and fall and then create a problem. Twirling around on the chair. I gotta make sure my, my shirt's down so you don't see my butt crack. Because that would be scary. Whee! Okay. That's Paul the Trombonist. Signing off.